Hey everybody, this is Aaron Wright and you are going to see a lot more of his face on Cairo 7 at 5, 6 and 11 o'clock and Aaron, people need to get to know you. So, yes, yeah, yeah. This, and I'm excited to get to know them. Happy to be here in Seattle. It's been a lot of fun so far, but now it's time to get to work. Okay, before, <laughs> before we get to work though, let's let people kind of uh, get an idea of who you are. Can you tell us where you grew up and your path here? Sure, so I'm a military brat, so we kind of moved around when I was really little. My mom retires from the Air Force and we go to her hometown, Spartanburg, South Carolina. So kind of grew up there, uh, went to school in Hampton, Virginia. Um, really, really loved school, loved, um, had way too much fun, <laughs> but I finished on time. So okay. got my degree, went to my first TV station in Rockford, Illinois. I was a photographer, producer, anchor, and I got a call about coming to Knoxville, Tennessee. It's a place where reporters really have to get into the community and learn what do people care about, what matters to people. Out of Knoxville, I got an opportunity to go to San Antonio, Texas, and kind of do it all in a city that was moving a lot faster. What made you think that your version of service was going to be journalism? That's what my degree was in, and I really enjoyed being behind the camera. So I don't know if it was you know, through some stroke of luck or just being in the right place at the right time, but a job happened where you get to, you know, you're at a desk in the, in the newsroom, like the information hub, answering calls and feeling the, the pulse of the day. Once you get that excitement, it's not something you want to let go of. You wore a lot of hats in your other job, so what made you decide to focus on these particular hats of anchoring and reporting? How can we help the most people? What is what is the story you can tell? What's the information you can share that's gonna make somebody's life better, that's gonna improve their day, that's gonna present them a new perspective on something. And that, that's how you have impact and that's how you help folks. 